Well, in Fox community, it's the Christmas season, and that means it's the perfect time to get into the holiday crafts with the family. And our Fox 33 reporter, Mata Drain, joins us from Ed's Emporium Art Glass Studio with details about what activities they're offering this holiday season. Good morning, Mata. Okay. Time to go to work. Good morning, Jasmine. Well, I'm here back with Mr. Eric. Earlier, he was showing us some glass blowing techniques, but now we're here making a beautiful poinsettia. I've already cut out the shape, you all, from this, and I made my little um, flower petals and leaves, so now I'm going to put it together. Now, Mr. Eric, tell us all about how people can come in and take these classes and make things like this, like I'm doing right now. So, anytime we're open, we have projects that you can make. It's called walk-in fusing. Um, you just need to allow for about an hour of time to put the project together. A lot of them are projects like this. We already have the base part of it all cut out and ready for you to do. Um, and then all you have to do is the, the man, manual work of cutting it up, chopping it up, laying all the pieces on there, and then we'll do the firing part of it. Um, this one's a pretty good project that we're doing right now. It takes about an hour. We've actually got some ladies coming in this morning. We are all ready for them. I have, a, I have a plate full ready for them to start their projects. Um, but you can just go on our website. There's a place on there called Walk In Fusing. You can click on it. It'll show all the different projects. Now, after the first of the year, we'll get away from Christmas stuff and get back into our normal everyday stuff that we do. Mm -hmm. Although during uh, Mardi Gras, we do uh, swizzle sticks, like stir sticks that you actually use for drinks. Um, we do a lot of different, we do like Mardi Gras panels where you can do pick purple and gold and make something that will hang up in the window. Um, we try to come up with a different project all the time because for us, this is fun uh, and, and being creative is really what we want to do. Okay. So she's putting that together, then what will happen is I'll put it in the kill, it will fire for about eight hours, it will get flat, and then I'll put it back in the kill, we'll put it on a mold and then we'll shape it so that it looks like what she's got there in her hand and it'll look beautiful and, and i can take this home with me and have it as my own dish you can Sounds and amazing. you made it yay and the process takes about how long you said well it takes this project probably takes about an hour most of them okay. between an hour and hour and a half um if you're doing like the the, the little ornaments and stuff you know give yourself about an hour but you can make about five or six of them that'll fit on a six by six. These are projects, we've got kids that come in and do them. Um, they're not hard to do. A lot of them we already have pre-made to where you can you can do them. And then what you wanna do is you wanna take your paintbrush and you just kinda sweep that right into the middle of it. Oh, okay. And then it's, and then it kinda looks like the, the center of a, of a poinsettia dish. Okay, or a poinsettia. Good. Yeah. Thank you so much, Mr. Eric, for showing You're me your welcome. shop. You guys, if you want to come here and just shop around, too, he has so many amazing, beautiful things in his area as well. So, stuff like um, lamps, he has necklaces, even um, plates like this he has. And, hey, if you don't want to miss it, this yep. is Mata yep. Jane reporting live for Fox 33 News. Mata, you did a great job. you got to bring one back to the studio. <laughs> All right, thanks, Mata.